to Free Coaching Thursday, every week I put one video out which answers my audience's questions. Let's just dive straight in. Hopefully the answers provide some great value. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Teach you how to do a little juggling a business uh, and getting a, a better results. So number one, how do I recruit for a network marketing business? That's a huge question, isn't it? But let me give you something useful right now. I would say zig while everybody's zagging. Like right now, you can see a pattern of behavior from a whole bunch of people that aren't getting results. So that gives you the ability to see what's not working. Often we get these people and they're gonna say, oh, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. It, it sounds good, it looks good. I got this widget, gadget, digit. But then you don't see them on the leaderboards. You don't see them rank advancing. So that's a good way to say, okay, this stuff doesn't actually work. What does work, Richard? I'm glad you asked. What does work is identifying a particular group of people serving that group with value, and then introducing your your uh, co your company, your opportunity, your product as the permanent and long-term solution to that problem. It's very, very simple. Like if you were to listen to what people are giving you, and if you're focusing on a particular target market, you're gonna have some idea what that is anyway, you could nearly always show the value and benefit of being aligned with your product or your business. Give them a partial solution first to prove you can do it, and the total solution should be your product. So for example, when I, if I was, let's say I was in health and wellness, which I'm not, let's, I'm using this example so you know I'm not trying to sign you up into anything. If I was in health and wellness and I decided that I wanted to focus on teachers, I wanted to help peop, uh, teachers become, you know, get better health, and at the back end, because they're good at networks, they know lots of other teachers and parents, they'd be great business builders, I'm gonna focus on the fact that they are busy teachers, they need something that can fit into a busy schedule and improve their health. And I would create content around that. Three ways any teacher can cook a, uh, can pre-package a healthy but fast lunch. Four ways any teacher can take one vitamin and wake up with 20% more energy in the morning. You know, just other teachery things, right? And then when they got that product, I would then say, hey, by the way, you can make money with this if you wish to, and we go from there. It's a very simple process. You can do it with anything, okay? That's what works. But you need to understand your audience. You need to listen to your audience uh, and focus on a group. Second question. What was my personal reason for joining a network marketing business? Great question. People don't often ask me personal stuff like that. It'd be interesting to answer it. So um, I, I came into this industry from a failed traditional business. We were making a lot of money, my wife and I, as health club owners, we got stitched up pretty badly by a big company that wanted the land that the gym was on. So they managed to force us out, did some dirty tactics. My fault though, I didn't know how to market my way out of it, which I do now, but I also trusted the wrong people. So I got to hold myself accountable for that. So I was really desperate to try and make, get some success back. I was used to making a bunch of money, having everything go according to plan. I've been working really hard and then it was all gone. 50 grand in debt, driving the car back to the dealership, it was embarrassing. And I wanted to find a way that I could get some money back in, but also have some free time. I didn't want to work 80 hours a week like I had been. I'd just become a, just become a father. I wanted to do something for my wife and daughter and myself that would put my pride back, that would let me get that spring back in my step. I felt like the life I had back then was less than what I could really live. And I was embarrassed by that. And I felt like I just was missing that spark. So I, I came to network marketing. I was like, this business, you know, we've all watched the presentation, right? With the compensation plan, we go, so I can make money without having to put a lot of time in. Like I can build a team and they can make money and I don't have to, wow, I've never even realized that was possible. So that attracted me. I was like, I want to be able to, to make money and have time and create amazing memories with my family. Um, and thankfully we did. Like it didn't go according to plan. 328 no's in a row over three companies, but since then we've, I'm so grateful. We sponsored over 700 people, helped other network marketers generate over a million pounds of the sales. And we've done some really cool and crazy stuff and continue to do so. So that was my reason for getting started. Um, thanks for your interest with that question. Uh, number three, what is a home-based business you can do while homeschooling? So when I get, I get these questions a lot, like you can drop the while homeschooling part. Like everybody thinks that their particular circumstance is going to provide a unique challenge. And 99.9% .9 of the time, it just doesn't. There's 24 hours in everybody's day and people are always busy. Now that may be a, a, something that somebody struggles with being a procrastinator. You may say, yeah, but that person physically has more time than me, Richard. Yeah, but they, they're, their struggle to find the time and overcome procrastination is as real as your lack of time. 
Like you may be someone that doesn't struggle with procrastination. Great. So you can't understand where they're coming from. They may look at you and go, wow, you're so busy. That organizes your day for you. How can you not find extra time, right? So everyone else always seems better off than us. And the truth is there's 24 hours in everybody's day and we can all find some time to build this any business. And the truth is that with any business, you should look at more about what you're doing with the time as opposed to how much time you've got. Like in a couple of hours a day, you can you can build an empire because you can start off, you can get a whole bunch of money and then you can start hiring positions or team or leveraging systems to grow that. You don't have to you know, be working 50 hours right at the start. Down the line, your business may take 24 hours a day, but you're not gonna be alone by that point. In order to get success, all you need is to find something you're passionate in, think about the kind of life you wanna live, look at the kind of business that, that would, would serve that and take a step. Like you may say, well, Richard, I need to know it's the right step. Well, there's no guarantees in life, only death. So if you're looking for guarantees, you're not suited to be an entrepreneur. You're not suited to be a human being. People say, I want to be in a job. It's, it's more secure. Your boss can come to you and say you're fired any day. The marketplace can come to a business owner and say you're fired any day. Look at people who have meteoric rises and just as fast failings and, and shortcomings. It happens all the time. The only thing you can guarantee is what have you done with the 24 hours you had? What have you done with those 30 or 60 or 90 or 120 minutes that you had and you could find? Homeschooling makes no difference. It's just another, another version of a circumstance that someone is making themselves feel like I need something special, extra different because of the homeschooling. People have things that take their time, that give them time, take their energy, give them energy. We're all facing pretty similar circumstances when we boil it down to the basics. Don't make it a crutch. Make it the very reason why you should succeed. Look at the life you want, the business that serves it, get a plan in place, take a step. You'll know if it's the wrong step so you can adjust, adjust, adjust until you find the right path. Impossible to do that when we're just all in our own head. So take action. I hope three questions is enough. I hope that's given you some value. I hope these answers you've maybe taken a sentence, a collection of words, not just one word, a few words and be like, okay, that's pretty useful for me. If like me, you are building a home-based business, uh, then you may gain a lot of value from www.richardmathrew.com forward slash YouTube that is specifically for network marketers who are looking to uh, automate their network marketing business using the internet. It's a free web class. Uh, you can find out more about that link. It's in the top couple of lines of the description or when it came across the screen as well. As always, go create a day in a life that counts. Always have more desires and excuses. I'll catch up with you soon. Bye for now.